from Frankfurt. This is the AFM Evening News. Good evening. Russia's national security advisor has made his first visit to NATO headquarters and officials there are pleased with the discussions that took place. Although the meeting was an informal one, NATO leaders say the talks provided an opportunity to set the stage for future discourse that may lead to a permanent relationship with Russia. Pam Proper has more from Brussels. If there's one point that was made explicitly clear here today, that is Russia will not be rushed into a relationship with NATO, but the door is now open. NATO officials are encouraged by the constructive and open atmosphere of meetings with Russia's national security advisor, Alexander Leibig. There are some fundamental differences on the approach that should be taken to a permanent relationship between Russia and the NATO alliance. Those differences, NATO leaders say, are not unbridgeable. Leibig concurred. He was confident those issues would be worked out. One point that NATO Secretary General Javier Solana stressed here is that NATO does not intend to create a monopoly on European security issues. I think that uh, we agree that at this moment it is very important that we all contribute to construct a new scheme of new architecture of security in our continent. And in that architecture, NATO should play an important role together with other institutions. We agree on that. We agree that uh, Russia should play a basic role in this new architecture. We agree also that the Russian-NATO relations are fundamental for that purpose. NATO leaders would like a summit leading to a charter. Secretary General Solana says NATO's door is open. The Russians say they will approach it slowly. Reporting from NATO headquarters in Brussels, Pam Proper, AFN News.